make it a great fight, girls. Come on! Buckle up, EFC 102 main card is on. Round one brought to you by Dragon Energy, Von Bank in the purple, Julia Duca in the black, and we are on and popping, and they are throwing. Straight away, it was a nice right from Crystal, but a good one too from Juliet. And that right's just found another home as well, but it's Crystal Van Vake coming forward, looking for the clinch up. But good disengage from Juliet, though, wants to keep the distance, but it's Crystal pushing forward. She's taking a couple of shots, that nice jab stepping out from Uka. Again, good timing from Juliet, though. Yeah, sorry, sorry, and it's uh, Van Vake, the overall big favorite here. That's an interesting outside line at 3.2 for Juliet Uka. Again, gets the left. There's Crystal and Crystal down, she got wow, hurt. That was a stinging she's, she's shot. She's backing up, Juliet's looking for the finish. Hurt. Crystal's just backing up, she's trying to reconsider herself. My goodness, not a whole lot of looping shots. They are right down the middle, and she is connecting. Oh, and big right. Feeling it right now, the damage is being done. But Crystal Van Beek's just biting on her mouth guard and coming forward, but she's eating a lot of shots from Juliet. As tough as Van Beek is, you can see the damage already. You can see the DNA coming out. You see the blood. Yuka is making her pay in a big way. Van Beek better find a different way to go about things. She's going to have to try to shoot for a double. She's going to have to try to grapple because this, this right here is just asking to get TK in. Yeah, Chris was looking to enter the pocket, but she's just getting so many counters in reply. And it's Uka has more power. She just ragdolls Crystal down to the ground. A nasty right. Just using it for a form of control as Crystal tries to get back up to his feet. See if she's able to do anything with it. A little over a minute to go. She's going to let Von Vake get up. You don't want to do against Uka. A big right cross from Uka. She's really time to tee off here. And Crystal's going to have to figure this out quickly because she's taking quite a lot of punishment. Crystal now just thinking, oh, it's a good right from Luka as she came in. Just think, being a bit more cautious in terms of how she's entering the pocket. But again, the countering striker from Uka just makes her think twice. And now she's surfing around the outside as Uka pushes forward. It's a bit more of a head movement now from Crystal. A massive change in fortune from Warsaw's betting as a great right cross from Uka scores on the face of Van Vek. Big shots, and she's not expending a whole lot of energy either. Simon, she's just hanging in there, and she's counterpunching, and she's doing a great job. Yeah, nice power from inside. Another nice inside leg kick, and great right wow. from Uka. Monique's still showing signs of life here, Simon. She's still showing signs of life. Yeah, and she's pulled wins out in the past in difficult situations. Just still trying to figure out Juliet Uka as Juliet really goes for those leg kicks. You can see the welt starting to form on the left leg of Crystal Van Beek. It's left cross from Uka and Crystal gets out of the way nice. He tries to close the pocket. Bit of a stumble. She takes some shots as she gets back up to feet. She's looking to sprawl now. But it's Uka got the top control. Happy for Crystal Van Beek to get back up. Like running into a brick wall. Uh, nowhere to go. <laughs> You cannot give me her one bit. Good defense, read it the whole way, and stuffs her and gives her a few right hands for her trouble, so. Oh, nice repeated right jab, the second of which found its home from Uka. Just jumping out of range from Christopher Van Beck. He's really trying to figure it out. Good body kick from Juliet Uka. That being said, just a little bit of time left, surely enough time to make something crazy happen, but it just doesn't seem like she has any sort of plan to get on the inside and get a hold of Yuka. Uh, just too tough. Yeah, and she's taking a, still taking a lot of shots. I mean, that was a massive right from Juliet Uka. And uh, <laughs> fair, fair gamesmanship from uh, Crystal Van Vake. Muzi smiled and laughed and acknowledged the shot. But she's got to be doing a little bit more as they both engage. Another great right from Uka. She's starting to put the combinations together and Van Vake's backpedaling a little bit. Great right uppercut mixed cross from Uka. It really scored underneath the left chin. That was a great finish from Juliet Uka and a great show of sportsmanship from both. Going to get Juliet Uka tonight. She just had a little bit too much. And uh, Uka is really on her way, Simon. I mean, the sky is the limit. Who could it be next? Could she have punched her way to an opportunity for the title? Or is there going to be somebody else that steps in there uh, that gives her another battle before we get to that point? That'll make it. Three big victories for Yuka, undefeated.
and uh, she could be on her way. Yeah, Chris indeed. Bank, you wonder what the next step is. I think with Julia, I mean, she's certainly got her eyes on being the first uh, Nigerian champion of the EFC, certainly one of the first uh, female champions in women's mixed martial arts from Nigeria. And look at that right cross, it was actually fantastic. Some really nice repeated jabs, mixed up, just causing so much problems for Van Veik as she entered the pocket every time, just confident in her counter striking. She repeated that jab several times. The last one of it found, found its home, and that was a good strategy for Uka. That, that, that jab was just pumping out for those three rounds and was really scoring. You could see on the face of her coach, your dad, Mosa, how happy he was with that performance. And gentlemen, after three rounds, we go to the judges' scorecard for a decision. The judges score this contest 30 26, 30 26, and 30 27, declaring your winner by unanimous decision in the red corner, fighting out of Nigeria, Juliet, the Golden Bulls, Buka! I'll just have a couple of words with Juliet. Juliet? So have a couple of words with you. Great show, you know, of sports and the sports leadership from, from both of you. This is a fight both of you wanted, but you've got to be happy. You're 3-0 now as a professional. What does that victory of a very experienced opponent mean to you? To God. It really means a lot to me. So much, Lord, because I was aspiring to get this fight since for a long time. But each time I have disappointment because of the flights and the visa. But I thank God I'm here to prove myself because the last time I remember you remember I told you that I'm gonna come back so this time I'm not just back but better than before and I thank God and I also wish that the FC should give me the belt the title fight because I know I want it because you know in my division I don't think I have any girl that can stand me from the beginning to the end in all my martial arts I'm the golden girl and also the golden bone so I'm ready for the belt as soon as, so give me the title shot. I'm ready for it. How much would it be mean for Nigerian mixed martial arts and for you to be the first women's champion of the EFC from Nigeria? Oh, that's going to be a lot, both in our economic and the force, because I'm representing the Nigerian police force. I'm a Nigerian police force in my country. I'm a woman, PC, Julia Tuka. So I represent the police and also represent the Nigeria. So I'm happy. Superb performance, we can't wait to see you back. A very arresting performance. Your winner, ladies and gentlemen, Juliet Uka.